Bibb County School Board says there's still a lot of work to do around the district and they hope voters agree. Kayla Solomon tells us why board members say they need a little help from the community to make several projects become reality. In the fall, Thompson Stadium looks something like this. But the Bibb County School Board plans some renovations to improve the Friday night football experience. Sports is one way that students excel and you want to make sure that the place where they're going to be playing, doing sports, team activities is up to, up to par, good quality and that means, good, means that it's safe. Daryl Morton with the Bibb County School Board says Thompson Stadium needs to be revamped. Replacing the track for one, making sure that we have improvements in both the sound system and the scoreboard to really to bring it up to date. The school board hopes to raise $163 million over five years from the East Blast, and about $15 million would be set aside for athletic facilities. If you have a field and facility you're proud of, I think that improves team spirit and improves school spirit. Inside the classroom, $20 million will go toward improving technology, including tablets for each student. You've got to keep up with the technology. It's changing every day and it allows students to have a device that they can use that allow them to you know use the internet and other types of uh, technologies to maximize what it is they do in school. They'll also spend 10 million dollars on transportation including 60 air-conditioned school buses. Uh, just bringing things up to where they need to be quite frankly you know we've seen really good improvement in terms of how our students are doing and I think it's important to support them by making sure they have quality facilities where they go to school. Darrell Morton says this is a continuation of the East Bloss that will expire in December of 2020. It would not change Bibb County's current tax rate. Some of the other items listed on the to-do list include a 2,000-seat fine arts center, security improvements, and a 4-H arena.